welcome back to Imperion Galactic Survival Alpha 11. We're here, we're doing part two of my ship build. We, uh, I have the figured out uh, that uh, I kind of like these uh, shapes that I got going on for the wings here. Uh, I haven't put a cockpit in to test the CPU value just yet. But I mean, here is the overview if you didn't watch the last episode. We're going to continue. Uh... We're going to continue with this episode and we're going to, uh, we're, we're going to build the, uh, yeah, we're going to, we're going to build this bad boy. Finish it up. Once we get these thrusters in, then the rest should fall right into place because I need to do all my contouring around these, uh, these, these thrusters. But all in all, I think it's going to go good. I mean, uh, are you playing Project Eden, anybody? Uh, what do you think of Project Eden? Uh, do you think it's a cool scenario? Uh, Raven did a really good job on it. I do appreciate him very much for his uh, how quick he got it out for Alpha 11. I, uh, I do appreciate his uh, go get him attitude as far as, uh, you know, uh, getting the... Uh, Alpha 11 Project Eden out so fast. I didn't. I figured I'd be waiting maybe a week or so, but uh, no, he he got it out pretty quick, like uh, the day of the uh, release of Alpha 11. Oh yeah, that is looking sweet. That is looking sweet. Do we have a color tool on us? I know we have a color tool. Take that out of my inventory. Okay. Devs, fix the drone. Please, fix the drone. I don't want to fall in the hole, so we're going to re put that back. The drone cannot texture. Please fix. Elyon Studios, the drone cannot texture anymore. It makes it really hard on sometimes when you're trying to build. Okay, let's go with the. Oh, we didn't even finish that up yet. Dark black. Uh, I want to do a medium base. What is she going to look like when I put, put her through the paces? Just, uh, I want to paint this up. Uh, you know what? Apply the whole block, please. Food. <sighs> Missed a block right there. <laughs> I know what I'm gonna paint it as. I got the color scheme in my head now. The uh, it's gonna be what? What are those? Oh, this is the small thrusters. I might have to contour around that. Okay. Back to building. No more playing around with the color tool. I got my color scheme already picked out. You guessed it. Black and yellow. Like B. Black and yellow, darkish blue. You know, those kind of colors kind of make me happy. Makes me, uh, yeah, I'm digging that. Okay. Let's close the back off up here. I don't know how well she's going to fly. Actually, you know what? Really? Thinking. Thinking we do these angle pieces, uh, I 
I know the, uh, somebody was uh, saying that they don't like when I cover up the thrusters, and I, this build I am doing my best not to cover up any of the thrusters with blocks, which is fine. I, it just adds another challenge for me, but uh, I hope you don't consider this covering up the thrusters or that, you know, I, uh, I do try to uh, do what some of my subscribers ask, ask me to do because, you know, you, you may want to take this ship and if the thrusters are covered and that's your thing, you know, you're just like, no, I don't like the ship because you cover the thrusters. So this is going to be a ship that is uh, purely designed for my audience. And, uh, yeah. Oh, yeah, I got a color scheme. We'll probably have to go to space to color this ship. Okay. You know, I'm digging just leaving that the way it is. Just like that. And maybe doing the same thing on the bottom down here. No, I don't want to do that to the bottom. Yeah, I'm thinking just leaving it like that. What would it look like if I encased it? Okay, stop adding blocks for right now. Let's add a cockpit. Actually, let's add a warp drive. We're going to put the warp drive at the very back. Hmm. Do I want it like that and you come in the door? Hmm. Let's plop it down. I need a cockpit so I can see how much CPU I'm using so far. Cockpit please. Thank you. Okay. Gonna need to put the cockpit down here because I can't jump up that far. So we're just gonna put a cockpit in. Okay, CPU statistics. We're at 20k. So we're at 20k and we haven't even put all the thrusters on. 20k, huh? We haven't even put the shield generator on either. Hmm. Can I make it up there? Let's open the door from the ground here. Let's just go in this way. Do we have a shield generator on us? We have a mobile constructor. I really want to put one of those in. Uh, we haven't even added storage to this yet. Where's the polarized hull shield? Oh, it's down there already on the bar. Um, uh... can't tell how it is. F5 up for a second. Just hit the side of my building. Okay. Okay, now that I added that, we're at 36,807. 36, so you either get a warp drive with this, you either get a 
you get a uh, warp drive and a shield generator and you have very min minimalist thrusters put in mm. this build might be bigger than uh, I anticipated it being because we well, I haven't even thrown in the uh, reverse thrust yet which uh, reminds me let's do that now and let's see how uh, This is not going to be an attack ship, so we can get rid of the uh, hold shield if we have to. I, uh, the, the main purpose of this... The main purpose of this ship and its role in the ever-ending fight with the Xerax is to... Uh, is to... Uh, yeah, fly around and be all that it can be. I haven't even had the cargo storage. Hmm. Yes, it's going to be an internal cockpit, so uh, let's start that out now. This is as far up as we want to go. We want to start with... Get the contour of the front of the ship done. We want to step down. We want to step down again. We want to step down one more time, I think. Yeah. And then we want I don't know what I'm doing I swear sometimes I wonder yeah fill that in How are you going to contour that in? I think you're going to contour it in with this piece. No, that's not the right piece. It would be the right piece if you were angling it out that way. What would that look like if I did it that way? That piece? No, it's uh, this one. I think it's that one. Right? No, it's uh, this one. Yeah, it's that one. Okay, technically the thrusters aren't covered up, but they're going to be covered up. I'm trying not to. Uh, actually, we can just probably... Yeah, let's just angle it like that. And then put a uh, piece there. We can probably uh, take out that one and that one. That one and that one. And uh, we can uh, no, that one has to be in there. Put it back. Yeah, 
you just have to be like that and uh, yeah I know that thruster's covered uh, that one's almost covered but uh yeah I can move the thruster probably maybe okay so we have our dimensions we're gonna bring this across you know I might need to make more blocks <laughs> We want something protecting the front. This is going to be a raised cockpit. That should give it enough room to, uh, You know what I'm thinking I'm thinking uh, the polarized hole shield is uh, I think the polarized hole shield is uh, not going to be needed we're, 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 the main, main focus of this ship is strictly, uh, moving, uh, moving from, uh, planet to planet and, uh, gathering all the ore or all the goodies. I mean, you know, a little bit of light combat. But we'll see if we can put the whole polarized shield hole in, uh, later. Let's, uh, take back my cockpit. Actually, we we need to you know what we need to do. We need to go here. We need to grab the cockpit. We need to go to the base. Go here. Go small vessel. Just make me another armored cockpit, real quick, please. Let it do the thing. Because we're what we're gonna do is oh the armored cockpit can't have in interior stop. Stop what you're doing, constructor. Oh, you already made it. He was too quick for me. I need that kind of cockpit. And, uh... Yeah, we'll, uh... We'll put this cockpit back. What's our CPU looking at now? 22. So, yeah, we're doing good. So, 22. I don't know how well she's gonna fly. Uh... Like I said, it's uh, all trial and error on my part here. You know what I need? I need some glass in my life. Since we're going to have a close in, close cockpit. You know, I'm digging the outer rings here. Devs, fix the uh, drone, please. Please fix the drone. I need to be able to texture with it. You know, that would be nice. You know, a little texture. Okay. We want the interior cockpit. Which one do we want? Do we want that one? What's that look like? What's that one look like? I don't think it really matters on the interior cockpit. Let's go with that one. Man, uh, F4. Muck me out some windows, please. I need, we want the armored ones, right? Yeah. Just muck me out a hundred of them, please. Well, I'm, I'm, I'm trying to take in the vast scope of what this ship is is just turning into right now <laughs> it's not looking eh, eh, uh, 
She's not looking too bad. I mean, could be worse. They're, her main focus is, uh, oh yeah, we need to start putting the components in. Yes. Okay. So where is the leg at? Right here. I can't jump up there from here but I can jump up there from here oh, man I almost made it oh I was in come on there we go okay why because I need to draw a line so I get these properly no please don't go big go back Go back to being black. Okay, so now let's switch it to the small one so we can, uh... That's where a thruster is, right? Yeah, okay. That's where a thruster is, right? Okay. So we need to knock out, boop, 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 and boop, 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 okay. We need to put in uh, a generator. Uh, where are you, you said generators? Generators, where are you? I am losing my mind. Uh, generators, generators, generators. Well, we don't need the polarized hole shield. We need generators. Where are the generators? Did it not make my generators, or am I just bypassing them like an idiot? There's the fuel tanks. There they are. Only two of them? We may need more than that. But, uh,. Let's stick with one right now, and then, uh, yes, we haven't even added RCS in here, we're gonna add, uh, we're gonna add the RCS right here, so T4 RCS please. I just want to put two in for now. Okay, so she should be fully functional. So let's go to uh, base. She should be able to fly if, we, if my thing is possible. So how are we doing on CPU units? We're at 24K out of 40. Okay. Where's the middle line to this? One, one, two, two. So this is the middle line. There's nothing out there, Storm. You uh, need to put those blocks back, buddy. Yeah. Actually, we can put the uh, the constructor right back here. That'd be a good spot for it, I think. If you're wondering why you you want a constructor in the uh, in the build, if you're going to be building a small vessel that uh, can warp, so you can refine pen tax it on the uh, go. Yeah, I like that. I'm thinking uh, some black. And then making the constructor yellow, because it's, uh, yeah. Those are going to be yellow. That's going to be yellow. We can take all this back now. Okay. We need a K cargo controller. Cargo controller, please. 
We want two of them? Maybe. I don't know. Okay. So we need to think about some sideways thrust real quick. I'm thinking... Dead center of the of the uh, yeah dead center. Yes, I made enough thrusters for this bad boy. That was a misclick by my part. One that I will rectify right now. Okay, so we need a cargo extender because that's what this whole main purpose of this uh, ship is. So that is a cargo container. Let's uh, take back this and this. And let's start adding some uh, cargo containers here. We're going to go all the way up to the front and run it all the way back. What kind of space does that give us? That only gives us 4,000. Yeah, we're going to need to uh, make a little bit more... Uh, What's that give us now? Seven thousand. That's not great. That's not very good. It, that, it, it needs to be like more than that. Damn, I can't get back up there. Well, you can always start knocking out the sides. Yeah, that's true. Actually, uh. You build my windows? Yes, you did. You're so awesome, base. I don't know what I'm doing. Somebody help me. That's a lot of windows, but that's okay. I like the uh, the concept that I'm going with.
I know, she's a brick, a flying brick. I am horrible at designing ships these days. But uh, what do we have left for, we have six thrusters. Okay, that's not gonna be, it's not gonna be enough for downwards thrust. So we want one there, one, one there. Actually, you know what? Put those blocks back. Yeah. We're gonna need more small thrusters. Let's do uh, six, twelve, twenty four of them. She's gonna be a flying brick. Okay, let's kick her off her stand real quick. Okay, she's kicked off her stand. She has fuel in her. Ah, oh, I was up there. You know what? Unlink for now. Uh, we're definitely gonna need to put a pentaxid tank in if we're gonna go warpity warp. That's the outside world. And you don't have a core in here because you deleted it, you Nimrod. Now, uh, put a core in. Uh, where do I want the core? I think I want the core at the back of this ship. There we go. Oh yeah, it's because I don't have the, uh, you know, I was, I was, uh, moving it around and I was like, man, this is pretty, uh, pretty, uh, sluggish. And then I realized, uh, I forgot to put these extenders in. So let's do that now. We're going to put them right next to the chair here. Okay, now let's try that. Oh yeah, she dances. Let's go, uh, let's go, uh... No. She's kind of squirrely. I ain't gonna lie. Level off. So what do you think? She is a flying brick. Actually, how many minutes of power does she have left? 811 minutes?
What's the statistics on it? We have 10k more to go. Okay, hold on. Let's see. I need uh, the rest of the cargo containers because this is what the ship is mainly mainly uh, designed for. How much space does that give us now? Ten thousand. What did that say? Ten thousand or a hundred thousand? Ten thousand. Sixteen thousand. Can't tell. Okay, this block needs it. Did we just unlink from the bar? Okay, so uh, T. Before, let's grab our extensions back. Where'd they go? Right here. What are you doing? Uh, actually, let's do that one and then let's turn it like to like a so. There we go. How much do we got now? 19,000. I wonder if she can lift 19,000. Should we take her on a little trip? In our little rocket ship? Actually, uh, uh, where's the other thruster? It's three apart, right? One, two, three, so. I need some hardened steel blocks back, please. Hmm. How many minutes? It said she had tons of power, but I really doubt she's going to last that long. I don't know where. Where's the generators at? Let's, uh. Let's add a couple more uh, fuel tanks. Okay. No, I didn't mean to do that. Actually, mm, no. So, uh, What is out there? Oh, the other main thruster. Okay. I was gonna add some uh, more fuel tanks. You know what? Let's take that out of there. Take that out of there. Let's take the RCSs. And, uh, forgot what I was doing here. No, I don't want that RCS over there. I want it over here. I want two RCSs. That's all I need is R two RCSs. My dude's getting hungry. The timer's ringing. Just everything's falling apart. Okay, we need the pentaxid tank because uh, you can't warp anywhere without a pentaxid tank. Uh, I know this is a crummy design, but uh, I'll get better with time, I hope. 
We haven't built the wireless connector yet. We need to put that in. What? We need to put the O2 thing in too. So much stuff to do. I can't remember what I was looking for. Oh yeah, pentaxid tank. Here's some more fuel tanks if we need them. Where are you, pentaxid tank? I'm not seeing you. Am I blind today? I'm not seeing it. Did I already put it in? That could be the uh, a uh, possibility. Let's uh let's put the fuel tanks in real quick while I'm thinking about it. Wireless connection. Hmm. Where'd my color tool go? There's the Pentax tank. It's in my inventory. I'm like, where is it? Doesn't need to be uh, exposed or doesn't need to be out in the open. So we'll go like that, and then we'll uh, we'll seal in this area. If I need to, I'll cut out some extenders, but uh, I try not to. Okay. We need the uh, color tool back. We need medium. We need whole block. We need that one. Color black, please. Thank you. Don't worry, we'll repaint everything later. This is just a once over. Come on. Paint everything black, please. Okay, so now that the uh, blackness has made its way. That's right, yellow's coming back, boys. Yellow and black, my colors. Yeah. The cockpit can be yellow. Those navigation blocks can be yellow. The cargo container can be yellow. So yeah, 19,207. Don't know if she can lift it. Don't know if she can move it. Uh... She's setting at uh, 3,200 of CPU. So uh, what we're going to do is we're going to grab the mini guns because we didn't put any on like fools. And we're going to go outside and put these on. So what do you think of the ship? Oops. Uh, black. I need, to, I need to paint the rest. I need to do something with these blocks right there underneath there. <sighs> yeah, she looks... You know what? I, I really think they should add... Uh... They should really add uh... turrets for uh, small vessels. Okay. So what we're going to do is we're going to muck out one, two, three. Uh, one, two, three. That's right, six Gatlin guns. You guessed it, yellow baby. It's my scheme. I like yellow. You can paint it whatever you want to when you bring it into your world. I uh, I implore you to put it colors that you want that uh, you are willing to uh, put in yourself. Oh, these need to be black back here. Whoops. There we go. Okay, we need some more. Okay, so what are we setting up for CPU now? Now that I put the Gatling guns on. 36,000. So, uh, if we, you wanted a polarized shield, you couldn't get it. 
you would have to sacrifice the uh, you would have to sacrifice uh, the warp drive. You know what? What if I take this out? What does that What does that give me if I take that out? Does that give me six thousand more? I would be over by eight hundred and ninety-two if I uh, if I put the polarized hole shield in. Well, what does that do for performance-wise? Give me the polarized shield, and we'll uh, we'll check real quick. What's that give me for? Let's uh. What's that give me for CPU now? We're over by uh, oh, 82 for efficiency. Let's see how she flies. Let's go over. Uh, let's turn off symmetry mode before I make myself sick. Let's go over and see about uh, what do we need the most? We probably need Prometheum the most. Yeah, I'm going to have to add more thrusters. And I didn't add an ammo box. So she won't be able to get a shield. But, uh, I mean, I don't want to take her into combat. She's not meant for combat. She's meant for... Uh, basically, uh, flying to each of the deposits. Killing the drones that are around the deposits. So that we can, uh, you know, loot them. But this is where I'm going to call the video. I know it's a little long, 47 minutes or 48 minutes. But I do hope you have enjoyed. If you did, make sure you storm that like button. Oh yeah, and give me a name for the ship. And uh, if you're new here, subscribe for more, more videos. Okay, everyone. Take care. Happy holidays. Bye-bye.